YouTube, what is going on, you guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be playing some DMZ. I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the rare weapon case solo. Now, it's going to be a simple tutorial video for you guys, man. It's going to be crazy. Now, it's actually a simple way to actually get this weapon case solo. So, anyway, let's get into the gameplay. If you guys enjoyed the gameplay, drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel. And I'll uh, see you guys next time and let's get it. Uh, uh, you guys, so one of the first things you guys want to do is make sure you guys have a secondary weapon. If you guys have not extracted anything before and you don't have a secondary weapon as soon as you spawn, you want to go ahead and get a secondary weapon. That is the most important part. Get a secondary weapon. Another thing you want to get is the second armor slot. So as you can see, I only got one armor, <laughs> one armor part. You want to get a second one, which I actually messed up in the beginning. So right here is my secondary weapon. So depending on where you spawn as you can see this area where i'm spawning right here you guys i'm gonna find a safe and on this safe is gonna be a lot of money now i'm sure this safe is always gonna be here so if you spawn make sure you go to this building where i am right here um as you can see it's a small building i mean it's kind of hard to tell where it is but if you so right here on the bottom of the map as you can see is the building i went to so right here is gonna be a guy waiting i take this guy down I'll take this guy down so i'm gonna go in here it looked like it's another guy right here and i drop this guy i'll make sure i get all the loot right here you guys so i get all the loot and um let me see so i gotta I, i'm probably gonna switch that weapon it's a guy outside right now i'll pick up all the loot that i gotta play make sure you guys pick up all the loot man and this is the safe right here man this safe has a lot of money you guys i mean we talking about a lot of money so once you actually get to this safe right here you're gonna get a lot of enemies as you can see right here i barely have any armor you gotta make sure you have armor that's it that's why it's important to actually get to um a buy station so let me go ahead and kill these guys right here this is my second time actually doing this so i know this guy's gonna be here the safe is always gonna be here at least it was here for me twice so right here i'm gonna open blue 5000 8000 5000 8000 yo this is a lot of money you guys look how much money i already have i have twenty three thousand dollars already so now the most important part is surviving you guys so now we got to actually get to uh let me kill the guy oh no he almost killed me kill this guy oh my god you see it is it's hard you don't you really don't want to get into that much fights with these AIs because they do so much freaking damage. So I got my armor play right here. She, she going to see. Only one armor play I was able to get. Oh! Oh, no! Ah! I, I almost died, yo. I almost died. So I'm going to get out of here right here, you guys, because I'm not trying to die. One of the things you want to do is do not be a hero. Do not be a hero. Make sure you guys get out of there. So I'll find a buy station. I'm going to go ahead and get to the buy station. Once I get to the buy station, I had to buy armor plates right here. We got to the buy station. I got to buy armor plates. I'll probably get this um, FSS um, weapon right here. Let me pick this one up. Uh, I'm going to say all my items. Make sure you say all your items so you can actually get more money as well. So from here, you guys, you guys want to, you know, take it slow. Like, let me get a mask and let me get some more armor plates uh, because we're definitely going to give that. So now I'm going to get out of here, you guys. Um, I got enough money. I got enough ammo. I got my armor plates. Now I got to get back in the car. And then we got to basically get to the high profile gear. And basically, it's going to be a case that you're going to get right here. And this is what you got to extract. So we're going to kill. It's a guy with a minigun you got to kill. Which, by the way, I'm going to show you how to actually uh, kill that guy easy without actually having to fight that guy. So right here is uh, the area. By the way, I actually forgot to get that second armor plate. Um, oh, my God. So right here, some people you got. to. Oh, shit. So as you can see, I only got one armor plate slot. We were supposed to pick out the one that was two. Um, two armor in the in the buy station I, I i was not thinking about it so you if you get to the buy station make sure you actually come with two because it's hard to fight especially these guys with only one armor play so i'm gonna go ahead and take this guy out right here is 
you want to draw the guy out once he's out you can run and actually will actually chase you by himself that's all the things you guys want to do make sure he chase you by himself so you don't have to fight everybody just to get him now we're talking about doing this solo if you that's the guy right there so he saw me now i'm out of there you guys i'm definitely out of there i'm not one to fight this guy if this guy hit you with a minigun you are pretty much done especially you only you don't have that much armor plates on you so so now we got to get back in this car this is the way you kill this guy easy you're gonna get back in the car back in the car and you're gonna ring him over you guys this is gonna be the easiest way he's all by himself look at this boom he is done it is a one hit kill basically you don't have to shoot him if you shoot him you gotta shoot him so many times which is gonna be insane especially you fighting by yourself so we got the weapon case picked up right here you guys so this is how you actually get the weapon case. I'm going to actually get out of here now. So let's get it. So now we got to fi find. I believe we got to. I, I think. Okay, let's find another truck. You want to find another truck. This truck about to die on me. This truck just died on me, yo. So let's find another truck. This is intense because other players can see this briefcase actually being taken. Other players, real players in the map, not just AI, they see you with a case on the map. So if they choose that they want that case, they're going to come and get you. So you want to get out of here as soon as possible. You don't want to be looting too much. Get what you need. Get out of there right here. I was actually looking for a self-revive, which I actually got. It. It's a self-revive pistol. If you get a self-revive pistol, make sure you get it because you can self-revive by yourself, you guys. You don't need a teammate to actually do that. So right here, as you can see, I'm running away. I'm swimming, going for a swim before, you know, we actually strike. You know, I was a little dirty. Let's get it. So I find a truck right here. Oh my God. What the fuck is this? Oh my God, I'm trapped. Oh no! Oh my god, who does this shit? So I got out of here, got out of here. So we got out of here, you guys. So this is the armor truck that you definitely want to get. If you see this armor truck, you definitely want to get this armor truck out. So right here, I'm swimming, trying to get to the armor truck. Now, basically, uh, kill this guy right here, get it done. So, oh my god! No, they want the armor plate that I need. The armor truck, my man. Oh, oh! Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so intense. So here's the ammo truck. Basically, why I didn't go to the extraction on foot. Yes. Do not go to the extraction or uh, extraction on foot. You can, but it's a risk. The reason it's a risk is because one, you got AI shooting at you. It's gonna be a lot of AIs popping up on extraction. Uh let me go get to the bus station. Uh second, if you get to a situation where other players show up and you're on the armor truck, you can just run and go to a second extraction area so i'd rather be on the armor truck where i can actually take shots and then i can still escape if somebody actually come try to take it from me so right here the one thing you want to do is do not camp do not lay by a by, by rock or you know by a tree or anything like that stay on the truck wait for the countdown once it come down hit like five or six because it's actually going to start like at 30. Once it hit to like uh, 5 or 6, that's when you want to go ahead and get in the um in the plane. Ex as you can see right there, the extraction plane just showed up. So I still going to stay here. So the countdown started, you guys. So now it's at 14, 13. Uh, slowly, I want to make my way to the extraction. And then I'm getting out within, within like the 5 second mark. And then right here, I lay down. You Somebody can still jump in here, so it's risky. But at the same time, you don't want to wait until like 2. And they actually miss the extraction plane. You know, if something happened that you miss, and now you out of luck. So right here. But anyway, that's how you strike the package solo, you guys. If this video actually helped you guys, drop a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. And I'll see you guys next time. The next one is...